Over a quarter million new cases of invasive breast cancer are diagnosed in the United States each year, along with over 60,000 new cases of non-invasive breast cancer. Dr. Johnson Lightfoot at Pomona Valley Hospital Medical Center reveals a new tool for early detection, Smart Curve Mammography. We've introduced a new technology here recently for the care of our mammography patients called Smart Curve. And this is a small physical innovation that makes a dramatic change and improvement in the comfort and quality of mammograms that we perform for our patients. Simply by using a paddle, which is curved to compress the breast during mammography, we're able to both get better comfort and better separation of tissues, resulting in a better mammogram. So consequently, women will feel less pressure, less pain, less discomfort during the mammogram. Significantly, we think that also increases their compliance. That is, women are less likely to avoid the mammogram if they know it's going to be much more comfortable, much less painful. Some of our patients in the past, the minority but the substantial minority, have noted that mammography is somewhat painful uh, or at least uncomfortable. So most women have come to dread mammography. Now we've discovered that very few women find this new smart curve paddle uncomfortable at all. From a radiologist's standpoint, what we discover is that we get better separation of tissues, which allows us to see earlier breast cancers, earlier tumors, and it also means that since the tissues are separated, they don't mimic the appearance of a breast cancer. Consequently, that makes my job better, easier, faster, smarter as well. Diane Hockett discusses this improvement in mammography. The technology for the smart curve is very innovative and a big change in the field. The typical uh, compression plate is flat and it kind of has some sharp edges. Um, and patients find it pretty uncomfortable. Uh, with the smart curve, we've been asking everybody, how do you like it? Is there a difference from your mammogram last year? And there's not been one patient who has not appreciated the fact that there is less perceived compression. So we're still compressing the breast, but because it spreads out more evenly over the breast tissue, the patients find it much more comfortable. The mammograms are just as easy to perform for the technologist. So we're all really enjoying the new technology. Dr. Lightfoot tells us who would benefit more from this new technology. We found that this is beneficial for all women. Women with small breasts may be more sensitive and consequently the smart curve is helpful. Women with larger breasts, there's more tissue that needs to be separated and consequently that improves the image quality of the resulting mammogram. So it's really women with either large breasts or small breasts both will benefit substantially from this new smart curve technology. The enhanced design helps with comfort and early detection. This paddle has a nice soft curve in the middle, sort of curved like a breast mostly is. And the tar part that touches the patient actually has a nice roll as well. So just even looking at it, you can tell that it looks much more comfortable and the patients have agreed. There seems to be essentially no downside. By a minor geometric modification, we improve patient comfort, we improve image quality, and we improve women's compliance. So it's really quite a win-win situation all around. There's better compliance, better comfort, and better image quality, all of which goes to improve the care of women for the diagnosis of breast cancer.